Nice. Yeah. Yeah. Uh-huh, yeah. 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 Welcome oh. back to We Split the Party. My name is Alexander, and I will be your dungeon master of this evening. <laughs> Today, I am joined by. Yes. Four people. I'll Joelle, please introduce yourself. <laughs> four people <than> Joelle. Four. <laughs> Hey, my name is uh, Joel, and I play Gilwin Daylin, who is the uh, druid of the group, and uh, we are people of industry. Yes, I am also, I'm the other person of industry. My name is Justin, and I play Cal. It's going great so far, guys. <laughs> Every stream, clean. Plastic toy line. Hi. Hi, uh, I'm Mark, and I play, uh, I played Joy Velhiri, the, uh, the bard that was formerly in the group. You watch your mouth. <laughs> you say that. Um, <laughs> hi, my name is Emily, and I play Thorn. She is the warlock of the group. <laughs> Beautiful. A um, couple of announcements. Uh, Emily and myself are going to be at PAX East in Boston tomorrow, um, delivering a couple of panels on D&D things, embracing the chaos in D&D, and creating a, how to create an interactive and engaging um, d d stream on a budget. I haven't figured that out yet. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm there to answer questions. Um, again, uh, Emily's in Hash Browns and Hooligans, another d d live actual play stream uh, with Warlocks and Waffles, which is going really well. You guys just did episode three? Yep. Episode three, yeah. Woo! Three. Um, yeah. We've got some cool and funky things coming to you guys. We have a couple new things in for you in chat to keep you engaged. As you will see soon, there is a new uh, new way for you to spend your channel points. Ooh, spend those. gain some more channel points. You can uh, you can bet, predict, do all those fun things because there will be something coming to you soon that you will need channel points to achieve. Uh, any other announcements? Okay, last but not least. This episode is sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends. <laughs> oh, thank you so much for sponsoring <clears throat> this session. Justin, please take it away. <clears throat> this episode of We Split the Party is sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends. Every one of you who downloads Raid Shadow Legends through the referral link below the stream will receive an extensive in-game package. You get all sorts of exciting rewards, such as 50 gems, 100,000 silver, three ancient shards, and even Jolton, an epic champion. Also, with the exclusive promo code APRAID22, that's A-P-R-A-I-D-22, you'll receive an incredible bonus, a rare skill tome, a three, a three, a three, a three XP potions, and two energy refills, and so much more. <laughs> he hates so much. <laughs> Two trailer park girls go around the outside, around the outside, around the outside. <laughs> Raid is free to play on both mobile and PC. <laughs> the graphics are actually quite impressive for a mobile game, and it is genuinely a great time sink while on the bus or being lazy at work. Two trailer park girls go around the outside, around the outside, around the outside. There are over 400 champions to collect and customize and even <laughs> 14 new ones every month. You build up a unique team and can either battle in a detailed campaign or create a guild with your friends and, and battle PvP. Guess who's back? <laughs> Once you've clicked the link and downloaded the game, simply log in, finish the tutorial, go to the little sidebar on the left side of the screen in the promo code tab, Simply type out A P R A I D 2020 or 22. <laughs> 2022, no. Um, A P R A I D 22, and you're good to go. <laughs> Back again. <laughs> there are a few different ways to gain new champions in the game. You can unlock them, they can be rewards, or you can get shards that have different rarities, which will award you with a random champion. Raid is back. As if you need more incentive to pick the game up, once you reach level 15, guess what? Yes, you get another exclusive package, but we'll leave its contents a surprise for you. 
Oh, I love this prize package. Uh, even if you picked up the game forever ago, then forgot about it, re-download it. Now, with our link, get to level 15 and enjoy. Tell a friend. <laughs> oh my god. Legendary. Legendary Martin. Uh, uh, Justin's not allowed to write these anymore. Wait. Yeah, Justin. <laughs> yeah. I will never write these again. How could you do that to him? <laughs> Joy's still around. Thank you so much, Mark, for doing this sponsorship and Raid for sponsoring this session. Ah, that's it. Before we can now finally begin. <laughs> We come back. Cal. Set inside Joy's humble cabin in the woods. As you enter into your nightly meditation, you feel a warm sensation come over your body. A boiling heat coming from the ground and area around you. And then out of nowhere, tss, tss, hisses from the steaming pools and the small hot springs, small hot springs that you rest within. So you find yourself, hands at your lap, feet crossed. The landscape around you fading almost into a fog, just alone in your own mind. What do you think on? Basically, the Zetirian presence has, hasn't been much of a, a problem as much as I thought it would be. The, the upcoming war? Who's at war with who? Can I remember who the Druids sided with uh, back in the day? <laughs> uh, First roll of the day. 26. <laughs> natural, natural 20. Natural, oh my god! <laughs> wow. Wow. <clears throat> so good. As you sit in your pool of steam, visions start to appear in the fog. Pages that form to pictures, that form to scenery of the world, from books you've read, interactions you've had, moments you've shared learning about this time hundreds of years, a little over a hundred years ago. The Otalans, the druidic nature of Otalans, they had sided with the nations of Torvea, being once part of Zetire, now found a new home here in Torvea. They had bound themselves to protect it, um, not unlike the Amarantine themselves. When the Zetirians invaded, the Gnomish settlement of Nebulus was the first to fall, and the Otalans quickly picked up hand, trying to find allegiance with the allied nations of the northern coast, and ultimately bringing in the cavalry of the Amaranthine elves to fight back to the Zetirians and stop them at Albanum. And Gilwin's situation with Master Sazir and him potentially being connected to the Nokian Empire, and wh why would he have a stone of sending stone f f for the Oculus? Mm. Roll an insight check. <laughs> that is only five. Five. <laughs> yeah. um, visions appear in the fog again, but of your recent interactions, of what you found at his year's house. The, conversations you had with Ifri LaRoche. Um, there are visions where you're speaking with some of your mentors and masters in the mountains of Nokia, but their words are a little jumbled. You can't quite fixate on them too well. As soon as they start to clear a little, you see, um, for a moment, uh, Madhi Fatal shake hands with like an older gentleman wearing like a black and red robe with the symbol of a candle on his shoulder. The face is blurred, and as it comes into view, it cracks. The fog drops like a waterfall. You hear a loud splash as the steam dissipates. You thrust open your eyes, and look out the windows. You can see the doors just 
as a face turns at the wood line. You see two pink and white glowing eyes. And it darts into the trees. Without hesitation, I'll get up and who's, is there anybody around me? You look around, you see Joy, you see uh, Hannah, you see uh, Gilwyn, Freya, but no Thorn. I'll uh, cast Dancing Lights and as I'm leaving the door, shout, Wake up! Thorn's gone! And I'll have the lights trail behind me like a little Boop. Boop. <laughs> <laughs> the floating baubles. <laughs> as I chase you awake. Uh, uh, what? Where's Thorn and Cal? Let's, let's go. I I I think they're I think they're gone. Let's go. Oh, okay. Who's gone? Freya sits up. Let's go. Uh, I Thor- Freya's hand and just start trying to pull her. Okay. You guys step out of the cabin, Justin or er, Cal. <laughs> you rush to the wood line. Uh, Can I see where she went? Roll a perception check. Oh, goodness. Uh, eight. Eight. <laughs> you look into the woods and you can see, as you rushed over, you heard like cracks uh, of twigs breaking as she darted through. But as you get over there, it's still blackness, just at the edge of your vision. What is going on? Uh, thorns run off again. Right. Um, what do we do? Cal? Get her? Uh, how Thor- thick How thick is the woods at this part? It's pretty thick. And it is, Jesus. you can't really tell what time it is. You guys have not completed your long rest, but the sun is not in the sky. Uh, Thorn, gone with the bag of holding? Yeah, Freya, I don't have, what? we don't have time for this. I don't, uh, Joyce running inside into the check? forest. What does that matter? Roll an inside check. Yeah, what the hell? That's so, that's so awkwardly like. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I rolled a sixteen with my plus five inside. Ooh. Ooh. Twenty one. Ooh. 21. 21. 21. 21. Rolling high, guys. LeBron James. Um. Oh yeah, we're rolling high. It's four twenty, baby. <laughs> Are we allowed to, are we allowed to okay, welcome everybody to 420? Welcome uh, <laughs> to the 420 session. Welcome to 420. Just, uh, Freya just seems like a little confused by the moment and is like caught up in it. Um, nothing out of the ordinary. Really? Really. Wow. Huh. Interesting. Um, Bag of holding. Let's go. Uh, Cal, I'm going to start looking for Cal. I, I, if I can action dash. Anything? Yeah, yeah, you guys rush up to Cal, get up, right up to the wood line. You guys are rushing into the forest. I can't find her tracks. I, I don't know which way she went. Can I see through it? I have uh, dark vision. You look in through the forest, roll a perception check. Nice. Kobe. Nine. Nine. <laughs> um, even with your dark vision, it's only a grayscale, so you can just see, like, not maybe 20 feet into the woods. It's so thick and dense that you can't see past the trees that are overlaid by one another. It's too thick. Joy, the forest. I'm concerned. This it's night. I I kind of recognize that. Yes, I I don't want Thorn in here by herself. I mean, we got to go. Can can anybody track Freya? Uh, I cast the tech magic. You look over to Freya, and every single one of you notices. She's like, as you look over, her, she's kind of like, <clears throat> yeah, I I. I don't have much tracking experience, but I can probably try. Please. Okay. She like goes up to the tree line. Was there anything, was it glowing? <laughs> it wasn't glowing, but she like, kind of like, oh, pushed something into her. Like from her, she took it out of her mouth? It looked like it. Uh, she looks in the forest and she's like, she's, prob- she's probably gone in through here. We'll follow you, Freya. Okay. Okay. <laughs> You, you're always ahead of us. Of course. <clears throat> Onwards. And she starts to forge and pulls out the battle axe, starts to walk forward. Um, she takes her time. She really just starts to like look at the ground, see if there's anything uh, kind of out of place or whatever. Um, Gilwyn, you notice that she starts to veer 
a little to the left where you notice a small like broken branch where it's clearly been freshly broken going to the right. She kind of just keeps going left. Uh, can I survival check? Yeah. I don't have my dancing lights around as well. Lighting up the forest a little, uh, yeah. 21. 21. Um, what, are you lo- what are you looking for? Uh, at the branch where she clearly veered left. Yeah, she went left. Um, you can see where the branch is broken. You can see twigs on the, brown have, on the ground have cracked. A root has been ripped up. Very clearly something large has very quickly moved through that direction uh, to the right. I grabbed like Freya's like, I guess. Sure. Oh! I-, I think it's this way. Of course. Let's go. She very slowly, stay behind me. Very slowly makes her way through. You guys all follow? Yeah. All right. I, Joy's trying to hurry everybody. We, we need, if we lose her trail, we could go the wrong way. We're gonna lose her anyways. She's way faster than us and she's running. Do you understand how dangerous these woods are? Exactly, so if we accidentally run into something, we should be quiet and ready for it. <clears throat> Goddamn hate it when you're right. I can kind of see a little bit further. I'm. I can f- see magic right now. Do you want to go in front? I don't feel safe up front. I feel safe right behind you. Right behind me. Let's go. She begins to make her way through. I'll get everyone to roll a stealth check. Nice. Uh, Joy. 18? Gilwin. 18. <laughs> 17. <laughs> all 17. 30, 20. Uh, and she's she, not there. <laughs> Should I roll? <laughs> <laughs> and um, she's disappeared. And Freya, like, steps, like, you've never seen her move before, like, on her toes between branches. Like, you'll watch she, like, Gilwin every once in a while. Between the two of you, you, like, unknowingly like, grasp each other's hand to stop from stepping on, like, a loud pile of leaves that has just fallen. Um, into loose wet moss that would like make a sloshing sound in each step. Um, you guys are silent. <laughs> Very well done. Silent but deadly. Uh, <laughs> good group name. Um, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's true though, we're very loud. Yeah. No, no. Yeah. Um, loud and explosive, more like <laughs> Thorn. As you lose that consciousness and hear that screaming sound, all you can see like a pulsing heart is a bright pink light that fades and gets smaller and smaller and smaller. It seems to be moving farther away from you, and the faster you move towards it, the farther away it goes, until you feel something like crawl onto your back and pull through you. As you're like thrown back, your hands feel stiff, and then you start to feel yourself crawling and like with immense speed charging through something. Things are hitting you like shots being fired against you. Branches are hitting your face, you're charging through. You hit this like large, almost stone like crack and just keep pushing through with like an incredible strength. You go farther and farther. God knows how much time you've spent. You're exhausted, but you're energized. You're terrified, but you're angry. Then you start to feel weary and tired. The pink light stops moving away. You get closer and closer. We have to hurry. Go, run, run! As you feel your hands become your own and you're continuing to charge through, but your your vision starts to come clear as you start to see trees flying past you at an immense speed. You strengthen your arms you've never felt. Your arm brushes a branch a few feet away from you. Your biceps are so big. You see like massive, like, Once again, like bark growing up your body, clawed back hind legs, and like brutish claws at your hands. Um, Do you continue to charge forward? Yeah. Like a glowing light. (laughs) (laughs) Like a glowing light in the forest, hundreds of yards away. You can see it perfectly clearly. The only thing is a small glint of pink light as the trees brush by. You can see the moon lit above through the peaking branches. And you're, hurry. Before it's too late. It's too late. 
you feel yourself start to slow. And strength starting to fade. You start to slow down. You get a bit of a glimpse ahead of you. You see a figure standing seven, eight feet tall. You can only see in black and white, but there's a large horn like a rhino protruding from its head. Humanoid, standing bipedal, built with wide muscles, wide like shoulders. Um, you see, kind of stops. He was walking towards you, stops. You're a little bigger than I expected. <laughs> we were told to capture a girl. <laughs> you have complete control of yourself in sulk form. Whoa. What would you like to do? Sulk smash. Can I, oh yeah, I know, right? <laughs> can I, hmm. Can I take a look, took a look around to see if there's like any traps? <laughs> Yes! Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow! We yeah. checked the traps! Yay! We did it, guys! Okay, you, can, traps. you can roll either perception or survival. Okay. Oh, nat 20! Fuck yeah, either one is great! Perception, we're going with perception. Um, that's a uh, 22. A quick dart around, you feel like animal instincts kick in as you hear like <laughs> just barely Wind blows through the trees, but there's a larger blockage creating like a whistle between the tree and something standing on a branch, maybe 20 feet behind you up in the tree. You hear a small whistle and a click of a bolt being loaded into a crossbow. Crossbow is loaded. Uh, Can I try to grab the guy in front of me and spin him around? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Roll a grapple check. No. Roll a grapple With check. No. No. Cause Cause surprise. Because folk surprise. Okay. Okay. Grapple checks. Just a strength check, right? Yes. Okay. What's my strength again? Is folk? Twenty. Twenty. Okay. Plus so it's a five. ten plus five. Fifteen. Fifteen. What the heck? All right. All right. Plus five. <laughs> <laughs> so in a quick second, your ear like twitches as you hear the click, and in one. Fell swoop, you grab the ground, rip yourself forward and like fly almost through the air towards him. Grab him by the chest and he's stocky. Quickly wrap your other hand around and pull him towards. <laughs> kind of, oh fuck. <laughs> As he's shot square in the yes! chest. Oh no. <laughs> uh, that is a. Is that an advantage for a sneak attack? <laughs> <laughs> sneak attack, you ever know, been listening to Rogue in the Tree? He was surprised. Word, that is block. a yes. 26 to hit him. Fuck yeah. Damn. Um, well played. Actually, you know what? Right. I will give sneak attack. <laughs> um, we're it. it makes sense though, right? <laughs> we're, yeah. yeah. We're basically gods. <laughs> flanking. Flanking. Oh, that's totally cocked. Flanking. Uh, Ooh. You watch as he like, you kind of, oh fuck. <laughs> and like you, you grab him and you see the bolt like on the other side of him go through his shoulder. You kind of, uh oh. As you can see, like now, the, like somebody has like readied a crossbow in the corner. I'll get you to roll initiative. Yay! All right. Ooh, not good for initiative. Um, uh, a three. Three. Natural one. Ooh, yeah. <laughs> uh, initiative. In two episodes we split the party. Namesake. Is... Ankle biter. Ankle biters. And oh wow! Okay, you get three total. Three total, yeah, it was a natural one. <laughs> so, somebody else got a four. <gasps> oh, yeah. So, uh, from up in the trees, you can see the person like kind of jump from a branch to a branch to try and get a different angle, and you try to like shift them back and forth. They drop down mm. and are going to fire another bolt. They're going to take the minus five, giving you half cover. Okay. Um, to hit is a. 22, mm -hmm. what's your AC? My AC is 15. 15, so minus five is still 17, so that does hit you. Um, not, it is sneak attack because you do mm -hmm. have an enemy near you. Ooh. I don't believe that would be. Oh my God. No. Uh, 21 points of piercing damage. Jeez, you like pull him a little out of the way as you look by the bolt almost in slow-mo comes towards you and just catches your brow mm -hmm. and cuts by chipping the top of your ear, which you can like feel has like a point to it. Mm -hmm. um, 
That's his turn. Next up is Griff. He's going to try and break free. Sorry, what did you say his name was? Whiff. Nothing. Whiff. <laughs> <laughs> Griff the Rhino Man. Uh, he's going to try and break free. He got a natural 20 mm. for a total of 27. Mm -hmm. So you got to roll athletics or acrobatics to maintain. Uh, athletics. Yeah, let's yeah, see. Easy. No, nah, it's a five. Five. So he grabs your like meaty arm and just and flips you over him. You land on your feet, spin around right as he takes his uh, ace. Like he's got two heavy stone square mauls on his hip. He takes one out by the like rubber on the handle, spins it around his hand, grabs a handle, and goes for a crack. That is also really good. That is twenty five yeah, to hit. Bad. All right, all right, all right. Da, 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 mace. You take six points of bludgeoning <laughs> damage. Okay, six. Six points. Um, and he is going to action surge. You watch kind of, <laughs> this is way more fun than I thought. <laughs> and he's going to take two more swings at you. 13 and a 19 for a, a 20 and 26. Gee. To hit. I'm rolling really well. <laughs> uh, seven and yeah. Thirteen more points of bludgeoning damage. He pulls out the other one, swings around, just crack, crack right across. You're just like battered on either side of your protruding jaw. He's down. Uh, I'm down. Oh. Oh. I only have you're, 36 hit points. You had oh. too much fun, Alex. <laughs> <laughs> Never and everything. <laughs> um. Oh. <laughs> Whoops. Uh, <laughs> you gotta, uh, I guess this wasn't as fun as I thought. Okay. Um, all right. You have to get back Is to that, my turn. Did she get up? Oh, yeah. You're a half orc. Yeah. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> uh, you pop right back up at one hit point. That's his turn. Okay. It is your turn. Can I fix it? <gasps> okay, there we go. <laughs> okay, it's my turn. It is your Pack turn. Feature. All right. <gasps> Boom, you explode. You watch as like in this hulking form, you feel your legs strengthen once more and that strength comes back to you. Roll a d12. 12. I just murder everyone. Eight. Eight. Oh, let me we check. We give you permission to murder. Features. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ, you gotta stop rolling eight. Why? In the dark, <laughs> in the darkness. <laughs> No. He looks at you, afraid, as the magic bursts from you within you. You start to glow, your eyes bright and pink, and you just turn a color bright yellow. Cool, 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 cool. <laughs> um, that was just a bonus action, right? Mm -hmm. So um, I'm gonna Misty Step. Misty Step. Oh, I guess that's also a bonus action. Can I do that? Mm, yeah, you can upgrade a bonus action to an action. I'm making that call now. Okay, cool. So then I will Misty Step. 30 feet. All right, you <laughs> teleport away. You can see them both now. They were trying to flank you, but couldn't quite position themselves well. Roll another d12. Four. Four. Oh. You, you feel that strength like ripple. Your claws grow. You gain the multi-attack feature. Nice. Your unarmed strikes become 1d4 plus five. Mm -hmm. um, and you are concentrating on this effect. Your strength is still 20. Okay, so that was 1d4 plus 5, right? For your, your and you have multi-attack. Multi uh, top of the round is Zordis. Who? Zordis. Z Zordis. Oh no, I just turned off his character, hold on. <laughs> he's dead. Yeah, we don't need him, he's fine. He died. He's fine. Is he the shooter? He shot himself. He's the shooter, yeah. Um, he kind of... Flank around him, we, 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 we can't, we have to get the fucking... Do you see a bag? Do you see a bag? Uh, and he kind of, I don't know. Um, he <laughs> takes a step over to the left and. Bum, 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 bum. He's going to stop for a second and then leap up mm. into the tree. You see, like, um, now you get a good look at him. He is a gray and black furred tabaxi with like wide, kind of droopy ears. He's got like a little goatee kind of scruffled around. He's wearing like heavy leathers. Um, he's got a crossbow on his back, a crossbow in his hands, and a crossbow at his side. Um, he jumps up into the tree and is going to take a shot at you. I doubt it. <laughs> uh, that is 12 to hit. Does not hit. Tw All right. Um, that is his turn. 
Uh, next up is Griff. He kind of, I don't, don't see the bag, but I'll go. And he like, you see him spin the hammers around and charges at you once more. He's going to take two attacks. Um, da, 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 da. That's a nine to hit. Does not hit. Oh my God. <laughs> Try to capture me. <laughs> oh my God. Hit. That's a 14. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> it's fine. It's great. Yeah. It's cool. Yeah, fuck you, Alex. <laughs> <laughs> it's cool. I don't care. It's your turn. So what do you do, huh? Okay, awesome. So are any of them within range of me? Uh, yeah, Griff is right in front of you, and the other okay. one's around 30 feet away. Okay, so I teleported 30 feet. Griff is right in front of me. Okay, cool. So I'm going to... Well, the other one's like 40 feet away. Now, can you explain multi-attack to me? So you can, at, with your action, attack twice. I can attack twice. Okay. Um... Yeah, I'm gonna attack Griff, who is in front of me. All right, go ahead, roll to attack. Okay. Uh, 14 plus, is, so this is an unarmed strike? Unarmed strike. Uh, 14 strength, plus 4, 18 to hit. Your strength is plus 5. Oh, okay, so sorry, 19 to hit. 19 hits. Okay, and then it was a d4 plus, plus five. 5, okay. Nine damage. Nine, nine oh. points of damage, you First reel thing. back Thank and you. you see your like black serrated claws scrape across his chest and you like cut across and rip out the crossbow bolt yeah. with your hand. Um, that fucking hurt. <laughs> uh, Next attack? Yeah. Kobe. Okay, uh, eight plus five, which is 13. Uh, 13 does Thir not does hit. Not hit. Okay. The second one, he quickly flips the mace around and blocks your strike as you like grab onto the top of the mall. Do I have any bonus actions? Let's see. I'm going to hex. Uh, who am I going to hex? I'm going to hex him. <laughs> <laughs> the, 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 now you can the see right in front of me. there is he is a goliath man with okay. like stone textured okay. skin and what looks like a completely stone horn protruding from his head okay um what is what is, what is hex okay uh you place a curse on a creature that you can see within range until the spell ends you deal an extra 1d6 necrotic damage to the target whenever you hit it with an attack Okay. Also, choose one ability when you cast the spell. The target has disadvantage on ability checks made with the chosen ability. Okay. So I'm going to take strength. All right. Okay. Just mm -hmm. on strength. Ten. Smart. Big brain play. Yeah, big, big brain. brain. Big brain play, baby. Um, big brain thorn. And over here. that's a spell. It is a spell. So please roll another d12. <laughs> oh, guys. Roll an eight. Explode. Fireball. So I got a six. Six. Six, 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 six. It's so much fun when she... Oh, God. <laughs> they good? She wins. Oh, she wins the You your already rippling skin fur and bark <gasps> harden like iron. Oh, you iron believe skin. you are... Invincible. It's because I am. Invulnerable. <laughs> invulnerable. You believe you are invulnerable. It's because believe or are. Yeah, that's a really, really important word there I feel like we're glossing over. Yeah. You, you believe, believe you are invulnerable. That's your turn? You believe. Yes. All right. Uh, yes, and can I, yeah, because I did my action and my bonus section, so we're good. Okay. Um, <clears throat> next up is uh, Zordus again. Just grab, just, just grab the bag and we can go. Um, he's going to take another shot at you. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> Try to take my bag. That could be a really your, high roll or really bad or low roll. 14. What's your AC? 15. For fuck. 15. For fuck. I thought 14. it was 17. No, it's 15. Oh, see. It's 15. 15. It's 15. 15. Another bolt ridges right past you and you hear it right into the tree beside you. Um, he is a, does not get multi-attack. Does, wait, does he? Because. He does no. not. He doesn't because he, he sucks. sucks. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> That's going on a shirt. <laughs> he does it because he sucks. Ooh, but he can. He watches this time. He licks oh, himself. It's too clean. late. Whatever. Oh. Fuck it. Fuck it. I don't care. I'm playing so many characters right now. I... <laughs> wow, two Alex. <laughs> <laughs> um, that's his turn because he didn't use his bonus action to steady aim, which would have given him advantage, but it's fine. Fine. Griff's turn. So he does suck. 17 to... Okay, 17 will hit. Let me just figure out the rules to this. Oh, yes. So, um, as 
he swings the, uh, I'll just roll twice. And the next one is a 19. Okay. He swings the maces around his hands and just goes and like bounces off your skin. <laughs> oh. Roll a wisdom saving throw. Okay, wisdom saving throw. So if you believe. Nat 20. Whoa! Yeah! Okay. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're you hear this like nutty. Ting, ting, as if they've like battered off an anvil. Um, it kind of like looks at you, takes a step back. <laughs> Does that provoke an attack of opportunity? Yes. Yes. yes! <laughs> he takes a couple steps back. He's terrified. They were told to ambush a little girl. <laughs> One, so okay, cool. <laughs> so you're like, you're in your confidence and you go to like backhand him out of nothing yeah. and he takes a step back and you're just like, ah, close your eyes and he's like five feet away from you and you're like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, your turn. I'm gonna dash. Which, where? Mm, away from them. Away. Oh, he just left your range. Oh. <laughs> Yeah, tell me smell. No! Oh, yes. oh no! no <gasps> okay. Uh, you can't stop me. You charge into the forest. Back the way you came, another direction. Um, do, like, she knows the way she came from. Roll a survival check. She does not. It's an eight. Uh, eight, yeah. <laughs> eight. You do not know. You've been turned around in the fight so many times. Probably the wrong way completely. Okay, so you just start <laughs> charging into the forest. Cool. Um, you hear shouting behind you. He's going to take a steady aim. Mm. Fuck's sakes. Oh, jeez. You hear the <laughs> as a crossbow bolt is loaded. Did you get cover because of the forest? Also, no dark vision. I feel like part cover, yeah. He's blind. Do you guys know that? His, that character's blind. Do Tabaxi's have dark vision? I think they, they do. do. Yeah. They do have dark vision. And cats don't. So weird. They don't? I thought cats could... Cats don't have dark vision. Oh, they're not, not... Oh, but they have night vision? No. Okay. Well, First, I mean in real life. Mm -hmm. You hear the crossbow <laughs> bolt click, mm -hmm. then released. Roll another wisdom saving throw. 19. That is a 21. You, f you hear like a whizzing from a hundred feet away or however far away with incredible speed and accuracy. You, s you feel it tink off the back of your neck. That's so with sick. With a perfect shot. <laughs> That is so <laughs> sick. <laughs> That's Still actually ever. the coolest thing. <laughs> like, um, hey, you told and you me not to roll another eight. <laughs> running up behind you. Um, <clears throat> does he have any range on him? Also, how fast am I? <laughs> throws his hammer. Same speed. Same speed, okay. He's gonna um, throw his boot. Move 60 feet. <laughs> uh, oh. He can't get that, he can't get 60 feet closer to me, can he? Um. He also runs, actually, what's his speed? Yeah, 30. So he runs up behind you using his action. So he's hot on your heels, okay. but he does not get to attack you. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> your turn. Okay. Uh, you get the sense that like with the last of your movement, you've moved out of the range. Out of the range Of the him? other gentleman, I believe. I'm going to. Oh, no, never mind. Ignore that completely. Actions, spells, I'm going to. How many spell slots do you have? Uh, I only used, I did Misty Step, Hex. and then I did Hex. Hex doesn't count as a spell slot, because oh. it's part of my level up. Eldritch. Oh, and Eldritch Invocation? Is it an Invocation? I got a spell from it. It's first level, I don't have. It specifically oh, says it's, use. Yeah. Yeah, it's part of your, you took a, a feet. A feet or something, yeah. yeah. So it's, it's something like that. Absolutely. Um, yeah, it's my feet touch feet. feet. Yeah. That's why it is there. Touch feet. So I only use <clears> one, <throat> um, feet. Feet touch my feet. one spell slot. I can cast. Do it. So he tried to get closer to me. Yep. I'm going to cast Spike Growth behind me and keep running. Nice. All right. So in the space between you, he's five yep. feet behind you. Yep. Just drop it. Okay. Yep. Roll like another D. 12. As you see behind you, the roots that have like connecting the trees mm -hmm. just kind of sharpen like blades and <laughs> throw up behind you. You're gonna love this, it's an eight. Ah, uh -huh. you turn from a bright yellow to, ooh, a shining cerulean. Oh, thank you. Beautiful. <laughs> um. Wait, you were yellow? I was yellow. Oops. For a moment there. Forgot that. <laughs> 
Uh, cool. Next up is I'm like a rave light. <laughs> um, you hear like cracks as he like jumps through the trees mm-hmm. to catch up to you. Um, so go- oh, twenty can't. foot radius centered on a point that I choose. Zordus uh, is in the trees. Oh, he's oh the the guy in the top right, Griffiths, yeah. who's chasing me. Never mind. Um, mm-hmm. Zordus sucks though. He's like not gonna hit this shot at yeah. all. He sucks. He's clearly sucks. I got sixty yeah. feet oh, yeah. away from him and then another thirty. So, so Zordus charges up behind you, mm. um, doesn't quite catch up, but he moves at a qu- quickened pace, okay. um, almost like near side you, and is like running beside, and is going to take a shot at you as well. Oh, cool. how fast? Guy fast as fuck. Yeah, feline agility, baby. Oh yes. Yeah. And that is for the kids at home, what we call a critical hit. Fuck you. Oh, oh no. no. <laughs> are you gonna try? Are you gonna kill me again? I'd like a wisdom saving throw, please. Oh, please. Uh, seven plus two. That's uh nine. You, oh. as you're charging away, ah. you ignite the spike growth behind you. You hear him kind of like step and crunch as the guy's feet like tear through and he slows down. You're like, oh no. <laughs> We've lost her. <laughs> As Zordis like charges through the trees, time slows a little, like the speeding motion as he's like so knee in front of, one in front of the other, turns, looks, cocks an eye. You turn to look and you see the glint of the blade against the, the glint of the arrowhead against the moon as it whoosh, fires straight at you. You lose confidence in your invulnerability. No. As the bolt charges straight at your face. <laughs> oh no! Um, this is not good. Are you see, going that to is, kill me? This is really bad. Um, but that gets a nice thorn paint now. Yeah, yeah it does. <laughs> Drop it again. But no one's no one's there to pick her up. Quibble is. Ooh, this is important. Oh, shit. Quibble. You're not within melee range, so he doesn't get sneak attack. Dang. You're lucky. But that is still 19 points. Yeah, oh. I mean she's down. She only had one hit point. Fair. Mm-hmm. As you turn, you see the bolt whiz towards you. Close your eyes as it gets close to you, and it all goes dark. Damn. Is Quibble there? Damn. You just see like a little. Oh. Wait, Quibble takes the bullet. <laughs> um, no. No. I would hey. say I would say you have to be conscious, conscious. to okay, control okay. Quibble, because that would be crazy. <laughs> Baby. Quivel I, took I can the understand bullet. That. You you like I turn. You him see him like me. perched on your shoulder, the wind blowing the fur back. <laughs> He's glistening. Yeah, that's flying through the forest. Um, that was a terrible screenshot. I shouldn't have done that face. <laughs> that's there forever. Yeah. That's, that's going on a shirt. That's yeah. clipping forever. <laughs> your vision goes dark. Oh shit. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. Good riddance. Oh, fuck you. <laughs> Stepping through the forest, or so quietly. Did we not hear any of the battle? You guys, after about 20 minutes of moving slowly, you hear a (laughs) of like an explosion, cracking, piercing sounds in the distance, kind of in the direction you're going. Fuck it. Let's let's quick, let's quicken our pace. Uh, I I I I'm, don't care. Let's go. It's Thorn. I, I, yeah, I I'll follow pushing. you. I start pushing her forward. You have to go in front. <laughs> <laughs> Roll a persuasion check. Why would I have to persuade her? She's my friend, right? Because I obviously yeah, that was really bad. I rolled a natural four uh, <laughs> for a uh, natural four. I'm four sorry, four. guys. I'm I'm lost. Uh, does oh, my no. detect magic go off at any point? Are you it's 30, fi- 30 feet radius. magic? Yeah, I've been to, oh, it's probably done by now. It's 10 minutes and that was yeah. last night. Uh, hmm. Let's head towards the noise. Yeah, we're pushing through. Who's yeah. going first? Uh, yeah, who's I'll like, go, who's I'll go tracking? First. You're tracking, I'll okay. go first, yeah. Go ahead, roll a survival check. I'll watch the mm. back. I'll still stay behind Priya. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> rolling that like, no, Yo, I'm rolling nutty Rolling nutty today. <laughs> 420, baby! <laughs> Actually, I think we I think we rolled four twenties. Mm. <laughs> As nah, all right, nah. you guys start to move nah. at a quickened pace throughout <laughs> the forest. 
um, Joy leading the charge. You know, you heard the direction and you can now see a perfect trail, a beeline towards the sound. Um, and you start to move. After about five to 10 minutes, the hair on the back of your neck stands up, Joy. And it stops you dead in your tracks. Being a magic user, there's just like a moment of uncomfort. You stop, it, like unwillingly, knowing like gun at your back. What do you do? Is someone out there? Why did I'll, we stop? I'll turn Joy, why'd you stop? I'll, I'll turn around, kind of slowly peering through the darkness, seeing if I can see anything. Roll a perception check. <sighs> do we see anything? Roll a perception check. Kobe. Just two. Dirty 20. We got 11. Roll under 11. <laughs> yes! <laughs> that one, baby! You turn Wait, around. Wait, friends are coming to save me. Um, well, actually, that is true. Ooh. You hear, as you say that, you hear a crack in the woods, not from any of your party members, but you don't see anything. Hmm. Uh, can I point into the distance at what it was? Uh, and direct, uh, direct Cal's attention specifically. Um, let's get some light in there. So I'll move my dancing lights. Throw the dancing lights through. They start to weave amongst the trees, some bushes, branches. You guys get a good look. You don't see anything. I swear I heard something, but I mean, this, these woods are all kinds of weird. Let's keep up moving. You continue on. And Joy, you take a step. Just that one step. Oh no. I need you to roll. It's like a magical oh, no. trap. This is how we're planning to kill Joy, guys. <laughs> no. This was it. This is the because we wouldn't let you do it yep. naturally. So. Story beat. <laughs> Wait, what the fuck? Um, Seriously? It's like a barrier? I need you to make a dexterity save. Oh, wait. I pushed Freya through. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I need a dexterity saving throw. Okay, I believe. Uh, that's a no for me. Uh, 10. You feel like a weightlessness. Like you dr like are, are, have dropped, like the floor beneath you has dropped. Oh no. And you guys watch as Joy is thrust <laughs> into the air, feet first. Oh. Um, <laughs> Didn't check for traps. <laughs> <laughs> Does he look like he's floating or something? He looks picking like him up? he's floating. One for four. <laughs> um, I'll get everyone to roll initiative. I will um, not give them a, a surprise round because you did notice something. We know this time. <clears throat> oh my God. God damn, man, I rolled a one too. My dice are spicy today, guys. They're super spicy. Uh, 25 to 20. <laughs> 27. Holy! Nice. Oh, damn. Wow! That was a natural twenty. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. We need a 20, natural twenty. Holy shit! Yeah. Okay. That's all I'm baby. Saying. That's, That's 20. actually really good. nuts. Um, twenty to fifteen. We've rolled at least six. Okay. Uh, okay, Picasso. Um, <laughs> I like it, Picasso. Uh, what did you guys get? Twelve. Twelve. Five. All right. Mm. Then we got Gil. I mean, and you're upside down. Joy. Kind of makes sense. Top of the round. Cal, you watch as he's thrust into the air. I don't see what's picking him up you or... don't see anything. Oh, no. Oof. Uh, I'd like to cast Sea Invisibility. Um, oh! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> okay, roll a perception check. <laughs> this just in. So excited. But I still use a spell slot? Yes. Okay. Uh, no, oh, that's oh a my. natural one. <laughs> no. No. Okay, hold on. <laughs> you use your time. Oh yeah, I'm gonna front. fucking time okay. the shit out yeah. of this thing because that one is not Roll cool. This is a 20. Uh, okay, that's better. Perception, uh, it's uh, 16. 16? <sighs> All right. Uh, you kind of quickly look around. Um, you hear in your ear. Too late. Um. Anything else? Uh, you like to turn around. You don't. 
there's at first you don't notice anything and then you see like a shimmering gray image of a masked person cloaked over their head um, wearing like pointed epaulets over their shoulders um, and wearing like leather wraps. Have we seen this guy? Oh shit, is that a... It sounds like every character uh, they've I've got, got like, head. They've got like, almost like a, you can see a slight glint of steel over their chest. Uh, it's hard to see much else, but they've got a blade, a single blade at their side. Is it, hold o on. Only he can see this? Only he can mm -hmm. see it. Okay. Sorry, uh, is that one of the, was it a porcelain mask? No, just a, uh, just a, uh, Regular, oh, like wrap. like wrap yeah. over his. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Okay, okay, it's a it's a male voice. You, um, you, being so close, all you can see is like a light, double red glint in the eyes. Um, bonus action. Uh, another bonus action. Nothing. All right, next up is flutter. Flutter. <laughs> you guys watch as um, Flutter. Freya drops the ax. Oh, it's about time. Takes a step back and goes invisible. Uh, opportunity attack. <sighs> but can I still see her? Opportunity attack? You can still see her. Uh, she, yeah, I, was, sure, I had my hand sure, on her back, sure. yeah? Go ahead, uh, disadvantage. Disadvantage, yeah. why? Because they're invisible. I'll tell you exactly where they are right there. <laughs> Wait, Freya's invisible? Yeah. Uh, Oh, fuck, I totally forgot what I was doing. Uh, quarter staff, uh, 13. 13 does not, oh, just hits. Nice. Oh. It's not Freya, it is, yes. It's not Freya? <laughs> what? what? Wait, what? Oh, hold on. Aren't you guys all shocked by this grand reveal? We didn't figure that out. <laughs> Wait, does that say minus one? Why? Uh, it says plus one. No, that one. 1d6 minus one. Oh yeah, because it's your strength. It's your strength. Yeah. Oh, okay. Uh, three. <laughs> three points of damage. Yeah. All right. Oh shit. Do I? It hits though. Like it. It, it does. It you finds you, purchase. Yes. You hit nothing, but oh. it hits hard. Ah. What? Fre Freya. Um. And then. Da, 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 da. I act concerned, but I totally tried to hit Freya. Uh, that oh. is their turn. Next up is. I won't say their name. Aww. You. Feel this like, oh, actually, I have it planned. Um, you feel this like pulsing energy behind you as you all hear like metal unsheathed from, uh, a blade unsheathed from a sheath. And then <laughs> right behind you, uh, you feel this like force, like a pull and push at the same time as you can see the glint of metal just in the shaded vis visibility you have um, as it like almost like shimmers with energy. Um, now you get a good look at the blade. It looks very familiar. Fuck. And he's gonna stab you. Shh. Oh, not good. Uh, not good at all. Um, <clears throat> that is. A zero to hit. <laughs> Uh, oh, wow. Misses six, completely, oddly six enough. Six to hit. Six to hit, does not six hit. Six to hit. Um, and he becomes visible. The rest of you see, standing right behind Cal, is <gasps> a like cloaked, kind of like ninja-esque um, character. They've got a book strapped to their back and a blade, in a single blade in their hand. Oh, fuck. Um, he is going to bonus action. Bonus. Ba -ba -ba. Uh, actually, he's gonna save that. Uh, mm, he's he's going to just stand. He's got nothing. He's good. Uh, next up is Gilwin. I do. So when he goes uh, visible, do I notice the little bit of metal under his cloak, like the little sheen of it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like he's got like wraps over it, but there is metal armor. Uh, Cal, there's Cal. I put up my hand. Oh no. Do it! And you guys feel as uh, the immediate area, which is probably 10, 15 feet, starts to get really warm. But the heat then focuses on that person. And their chest under the wrap starts to glow. Yes. And glow heat metal. <laughs> on, uh, on person. Cal, watch out! Ah! 
Is it an attack saving throw? Uh, it's a nothing. Uh, it just happened. I think it just happened. <laughs> I think it just exists. Yeah. Yeah, it just exists. Any creature in physical contact with the object takes 2d8 fire damage when you cast a spell. Until the spell ends, you can use a bonus action on each of your subsequent <laughs> turns to cause this damage okay. again. I will roll 2d8 since that just happens. Two, oh, d8. <laughs> Diamond disappears. Huh. Huh. You don't have to touch it? You don't no. even have to touch it. No, it's, nice. a, it's a 60 feet range. <laughs> 60 no. feet. What? I'm like, I'm in the rafters. The Why king is doing some bad work? shit. It's because it requires you to have find somebody who's wearing metal. And that's it just amazing. doesn't happen. And visibly, like I have to know they have it on. And just so we're clear, that's a Nokia sword? It is. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I rolled one eight and one three for a total of 11 fire damage. 11 points of fire. Uh, Cal, watch out. Uh, so action cast heat metal, bonus action chale chalele. All right. Yeah, uh, and... yeah chalele is a cantrip. Yeah, cantrip. Cool. Nice. Oh, Nelly. Does he scream? I want to hear his scream. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, as you like grab, <laughs> as you like reach your hand out towards the back, you, you guys watch as like some of the wraps melt away as the uh, metal glows that like white hot and imagine. starts to like almost mat, like mold to his body shape. Huh. Um, you just like, ah, fuck, kill it. Uh, uh. That's your turn. That's my turn. <laughs> yeah. Joy. I uh, do. I feel a rope around my my ankle. You do. Okay. Would it be my action to, uh, like I reach up. Like my boots upside down, my dagger is just like hanging there. I just reach up, oh my grab God. my. You don't dagger, have boots. And oh, 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 <laughs> you don't have your boots. <laughs> it's on my ankle, not in my boots. Uh, let's it's see. It's strapped, you know. Um, it just slides off because your feet are sliding. <laughs> <laughs> I've been oh in the mud God. all day. You go. You pull the dagger out and go to slice. You feel nothing. Like it doesn't cut through. Oh fuck! 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 Um, uh, how but, close? Can't you cast magic upside down? <laughs> you, unfortunately, you go to like, um... Can you cast magic upside down? Yeah, I don't see why not. <laughs> it's like you go upside down and you're just magicless. Uh, oh, this is crazy. <laughs> um, so yes, you're hanging upside down in the air. Oh. Was that my action to... No. Okay. Uh, how close am I to um, the people that I can see? You are 30 feet in the air. Uh, great. Uh, let's see what I can do. Mm. Throw a rock. Oh, wait, no. <laughs> Hanging upside down, you're three feet above the ground. Oh. Oh, three feet above the ground. Your head is three, like, you, your, your, your reach is three uh. feet above the ground. Okay, so how close am I to the people that... Very close. Uh, yeah, I mean, like, you're not with a melee of any of them, but... Okay, can I, like, struggle my body and, like, swing myself towards them? Sure, yeah, you can. <laughs> so sure. Awesome. And as I, like, approach, I just reach out and I... Boom! <laughs> just do a, th a thunder wave right next to uh, Cal, and I try to launch them. <laughs> oh, okay. We're gonna be an Arcana check to not hit Cal. Okay. Yeah, for sure. Nice. You're swinging <laughs> upside down. Yeah. Seems fair. <laughs> I totally have one spell slot left too. It's not a high DC. <laughs> that's a net one. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, <fuck>. Boom! <laughs> you let go of Thunder Wave. Go ahead, roll damage. Yay. Cal, roll Constitution saving oh, throw. No! Oh, <laughs> Cal's, Cal's dead. Everybody that's dies. Oh, that's not good, though. Con save. Uh, oh, 2d8, sorry. Is it not AoE? Is it just focused on it's me? It's like a cone, I think. I, right? I think you assumed it's, to it's, try to hit that one person yeah. that Cal was fighting, but Cal's it's not a cube too close. that I can direct around. It's a cube. I believe. Uh, six damage. Six points. And I got a 19 for con save. Nice. That's good. Um, got a 10. That's not good. Um, he takes the full six. You take three damage. Oh, sick. I blast him uh, fucking 10 feet away. Just, I'm aiming him at a tree. All right. You <laughs> boom. And <laughs> so you like slam straight into a tree and you kind of. Uh, Does he get extra damage because of slam damage? No. <laughs> How far do I like swing back? <laughs> Is it uh, a little way, a way. So you guys man. watch as like he's like, <laughs> so he's floating like a good like five to ten feet just in the air. Because it, it launches you, right? Yeah. yeah. The pendulum. Yeah. Okay, you, watch it, <laughs> you do you full like, circle. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> full circle. <laughs> but uh, when you come back, you don't quite hit the same spot. Science. Um, <laughs> that's your here. turn. Yeah, that's my turn. Uh, Tough round is cow. Oh wait. Uh, bonus action. Uh, I'm gonna. I shout over to Gil and be like, hey, 
fuck these guys up for me, would ya? Sick. <laughs> nice. Um, yes, Dad, stay in the group. <laughs> as you- Nope. Don't leave. Not happening. As Please. you blast um, that person, you watch as he kind of like, he's blown against the tree and pulls up his blade and almost seems to parry the magic, taking less than you would assume. Um, magic parry people, the worst kind. And uh, yeah, m much less than you would assume. Much less or like half less? Half less. M much less than you would assume. And uh, his blade is now humming with two types of energy. Oh, oh shit. Cool. Uh, next up is Cal. Oh. Uh, He's 10 feet away from you. 10 feet? Okay, cool. Uh, I'm going to take a beat. Confused. What business does a Nokian have in these woods? I'll put my hand out, kind of motion him to stop, and I'll cast Hold Person. Oh, Is it a charm? So it's a wisdom saving throw. Is it a charm? I have no idea. Uh, it'll say in the spell. Goes to the top if you click on it. It, uh, second level enchantment. Is that a charm? Uh, you charm the creature, it'll say It says that. choose a humanoid. Wisdom saving throw or be paralyzed. Okay. Uh, look at under effect. Does it say charmed? Effect. It doesn't even say effect. Uh, so like when you're looking at your spells, like yes. second level, first level. Oh, I see, say... I see, I see, I see. It says paralyzed. I don't, I don't think, think it's, it's a charm. charm. Okay. Cool. Um. Because he obviously he is has ways away from you. Resistance. Uh, that is a fourteen. Ah, uh, beats it. Beats it. <sighs> That smile on your face. <laughs> I'm going to. Oh, it's too Fuck bad. it. I'm, I'm, I'm going to full sentence. I'm in trouble here. I'm going to use it one more time. Okay. Nice. She's right in front of him. Okay. Yeah, cool, right cool. in front of him. He's I going. know who you are. I know who you are. <laughs> oh my God. Who do you think you are? I am. Uh, that is a 12. Aha, it fails. Oh, he fails. So he is held. Cool. He is paralyzed. All right. Good and to know. As a bonus action, I'll take off my mask. Oh. <gasps> What a power move. Absolute power move. He's a, he's a, he's a little turned on. <laughs> All right. Is it an action to draw my sword? Like, can I draw my no, sword you also? Draw your sword. Yeah. He like does a, this. And like, I'll just. <laughs> <laughs> Is that your pose? That's the yeah. pose? Yeah. Puffing out your chest. Roll, roll a history check for me while it is Flutter's turn. Uh, history is. Flutter's Freya? 13. <laughs> Ooh, ah, uh, no, that's fine. Um, 13? Yeah. Okay, uh, look at your phone. So. Ooh, whispers, real whispers. Uh, how many messages did you send? Yeah, how many one. messages did you, you send? One message, one to Gilwin too. Um, I knew it, you fucking piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> I wanna know, uh, I wanna know. The uh, Gilwin. Uh. You hear like a whispering kind of consume your hearing over and over again. You can't hear anything else but this pulsing, loudening whisper. Get out of my head. Um, oh my God. That's, wow. No, seriously, get out of my head. <laughs> run, run. Uh, is it a roll charm? a wisdom saving throw. It is a charm. I'm, I, have adva I, have I have advantage. All right. Yeah. Oh, wait. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah it's advantage, not immune, right? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Wisdom? Yeah. He's still taking damage from the heat metal, right? Uh, no, it's every. Uh, I have to make a bonus action. I see. Uh, 23. 23. That's, <laughs> That's a success. So good. Seriously, get out of my head. Like, I, no. Uh, I talked to myself enough. The. Whisperings dullen, and then... Do I know where it's coming from? <laughs> all around, all around. Um, then you hear, or... I spin to win. Yeah. 360 swing. 619. 16 to hit. Uh, yeah, that hits. You feel a sharp pain ah. in your, like, under your ribs. Um, and the whispering comes from the stab. As you guys see, no longer Freya, but a white and gray skinned um, man 
wearing like a like a head dark blue head wrap around his head. He's got like blue cloak over his back and he's got a dagger at his side. He's wearing uh, he's like taken off and like over his shoulder wearing Freya's armor, wearing her necklace. Um, and he's currently got a blade kind of plunged into the side of Gilwyn. Uh, you take dun, 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 dun. Seven points of piercing damage. Okay. And that whispering keeps going, and you take 13 points of psychic oh damage. Even though he succeeded? Yeah. Different effect. <sighs> oh. Um, yeah. That is Flutter's turn. Next up is the other, what you now know is a Nokian elf. Um, you did not move on your turn, so that like energy, that like coursing energy from his blade, one of them drops. He's like, <sighs> can he talk? What? He's paralyzed. Can he talk? He can talk, just barely. Um, is it at the beginning or end of his turn? At the end of his turn. Oh, hold on, let's see. Hmm. Is that me? I don't know. I, don't I think it's. His- I don't know if my sound is I off. See, I, I feel like it's probably at the end of his end of his uh, turn to give him like a. Um, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Cool. At the end of each turn. Sweet. Um. His head kind of cocks towards you angrily. Ten. Sorry, sucker. <laughs> You're stuck. <laughs> yeah. Uh. No, that's attack. Cool. That's his turn. Next up is Gilwyn. Um, so what is the positioning of everybody? Is the, the person who stand, stabbed me, are they beside me? They are right behind you. Uh. Um, and about 10 feet away, you see the elf. Around five feet away from you is Cal, and Joy's still hanging in the tree. About five feet away from me? Yep. Uh, yeah. Um. <laughs> <sighs> you have the, like, the cloak on, you have pee. I shush, shush, you're not there. Hi. 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 <laughs> and behind back. Heat metal. No. <gasps> Oh, All right. God, I hope She's that wearing. He, you said he's specifically holding the armor, right? Or he, wearing the armor? Um, Freya's armor. Freya wears leather armor. <gasps> she does. Mm. She does because she's a gangster. <laughs> I think not. she's just got leathers. It's not even armor. It's not even armor. Yeah. Mm. The thing around the neck, metal chain. Really? It's just rope. Item. It's a. It's, it's like a, a cord. Mm. Um. Oh, it is a metal anchor. That is right. Is that enough to do damage if it's on on body, on person? Um, they will drop it, maybe. Yeah, they have that option. Yeah. Uh, hard to tell. Uh, shit. Yeah, uh, I, I, if I turn around, I'm gonna get... I believe in you, Joel. You're, you'll think of something. Yeah, heat metal on, on, on the anchor of the necklace. All right. Uh, I just try to take da- give them damage as much as I can. Oh, it's this, it's this one. Watch your dish. That's not a lot. Three points of fire damage. Three points of fire damage. <laughs> it like singes and you hear, ah, for the fuck, as it like starts to burn and rips it off and drops it. What's the creature must out? succeed on a constitution, constitution saving throw or drop the object if it Yeah, can. she got a, th- he got a, like, roll the three. Uh, two. Two. Uh, yeah, two. So they drop it. They rip it off and drop it. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Um, yeah. <clears throat> Fuck. I, 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 can I bonus action potion? Uh, <coughs> yeah. That's a thing? Yeah, absolutely. Totally a thing. Yeah, I, I allow that in my home games. You can use a bonus action to consume a potion. Why I, not? uh, I'm trying not to move because this this stab in my lower hip is hurting quite a bit. And I can feel their presence behind me, so I'm gonna try to just like rummage through and drink this potion. All right. Glug back, a healing Gluggy potion. Glug. How much do you heal? Uh, two, two, two. Oh, six. Next up is Joy. Oh, sorry. Um, Eight. I'm gonna like spit around until I can see Gilwyn and uh, Flutter. You can, just so you know, you are restrained, and you can use an action to make a dexterity. Oh no! Yeah, at the end of your turn, you can make a dexterity saving throw. To try hmm. and. I shut up. 
Wow. <laughs> I'll say, I'll say you can, you can, you can, you can use a, a you can, we'll say, you go ahead, roll deck save. <laughs> How generous the, of you. Thank for you, the Alex. end of your last turn. I'm feeling generous. Pull the lever drunk. 16. Oh, that's fine. You're still hanging. Okay. Oh, no. Uh, in that case, I'm, I'm spinning around, seeing Gillen and Flutter, uh, and I'm going to go, hey, you were a lot better looking a couple of minutes ago, uh, and I'm going to cast, uh, <laughs> Tasha's hideous laughter on them. All right. <laughs> That's really good. Uh, wisdom save. Yep. This is a charm effect. Yeah, but they're not an elf. Um, or are they? They're no. all elves. We're being attacked by Nokian elves, okay? No. It's kind of gangster. No. Yeah. Um, I just think it's a good sign that I'm not rolling death You safe. hear like. Oh, I don't know if this is a charm effect, anyways. Yeah, it definitely is. Why? Because it's. I was just, no, it's uh, just this. Yeah. Really? Control. Control. We're breaking all of D and D right now. Hey guys, we're learning things. It's Tasha's D and D in an old new D and D. It's not a charm. No. One charm. Really? No, it's not. Okay. <laughs> um, Get wrecked. At least it doesn't. It doesn't like. It doesn't have to evoke the charm effect to be a charm. I guess not. So basically, we won. Weird. All right. Cool. Uh, <laughs> then never mind. Uh, it is a saving throw. Yep. Pollocks. I want to use their features. <laughs> no, that's fine. Uh, wisdom is eighteen. Yeah, that'll do it. Yeah. Um. Can I? Um. Just like spit vitriolically and, and just be like, I'm gonna get you next time. Uh, <laughs> and. Uh, do a, another bardic inspiration, but like the negative version for them. Cool. Uh, and also, I'm gonna try to get out of these things. Because All right, we, know we can. Roll a deck save. Uh, six, 17? That 16. Oh, yay. <laughs> <laughs> Drop down. Uh, cool, 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 cool. Ba, 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 ba. Sweet. All right, that is your turn. Next up is double around cow. I'll uh, point my sword. We don't have to end this in bloodshed, Quinten. But it's your choice. You've already betrayed me once. Who is this? Um, did you do anything else? He's. <laughs> he doesn't say anything? He's, he's kind of like... Uh, 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 okay, I'm gonna hold action. If he, like, if he moves, uh, I'm gonna cast a spell. Uh, what spell? A uh, magic missile. If he moves, got it. At second level. Okay. <laughs> to death. Um, Le lethal. Yeah, whatever kills him. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, next up is Flutter. Uh, as you uh -oh. drop the... Necklace she looks at you, grabs you by the front of the collar, and I was like, "You are so annoying." <clears throat> I'm just gonna try and stab you again. I should have helped. It's not twenty. No. Uh, that's my third one. Oh my god. Um, four twenty, baby. So that is double the die of the d4. So that's four plus oh, I didn't roll three that. is seven. But then 3d6 as the whispers get louder. Oh, God. You're fucked. <laughs> uh, 13. 18 total damage. You're good? You see, as from oh. the collar, Gilwin's trying to look tough, be confident, and his friend Freya literally just disappeared into thin air, and now he's getting, he's getting stabbed by the person we thought he was. He just goes limp. Oh, no! All right. Um, next up is Quentin. Um, uh, it's a wis con? Wis Will. Wisdom. Wisdom. 16? He, that breaks it. Yeah, he's free. <sighs> That's the end of his turn, though. He doesn't say anything. Uh, I, should, I should say, if he moves hostily towards me, if he moves, then he's like, <laughs> 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 In Nokian, right. <laughs> um, what the hell? Shut up. And he like taps on the tree. Um, 
and just like takes a breath. That's the end of his turn, so he can't do anything else. Uh, next up is Gilwyn. Oh. Roll a death save, please. We're gonna get another, we're gonna get a few pace ladders. <laughs> no! I've been missing. You know what, we need a little bit of love to this guy. <laughs> Show me potato salad. Woo! Is that Double 19? digits. Okay, 19, oh, oh wow. so close. Okay, that's a success. So, uh, death saves. I don't know if I've explained this before, but if not, for those who don't know, when a character reaches zero hit points, they go unconscious. Ugh. You have five chances. If you, every time it is your turn in the round, you roll a d20, just straight d20. If you roll a 10 or above, it's a success. If you roll a nine or below, it's a fail. Three successes, you're stable. Three fails, you're dead. If you get a nat 20, you stand right back up. If you get a nat one, that's two failures. So we have one success. Next up, Joy. Whew, you land. Um, oh, come on, Gilly. I, I'm going to just reach out and, um, uh, not, not right now, it's, God damn it! Uh, I'm just gonna healing word. <laughs> healing word. <laughs> uh, uh, die later. Don't, don't fucking die right now. Super over. <laughs> right now. Get Gillen. Gillen. Get up. Get up. Get up. Get up. Gillen. Uh, damn it, Gillen. <laughs> <laughs> I hate you all. Uh, Joy is just aging rapidly. Seven. Yeah. So is Mark. Uh, <laughs> that's seven hit points. Uh, thank you. Just so exasperated. <laughs> yeah. Oh boy. Uh, what? Oh my god, you're ugly. <laughs> <laughs> I. <laughs> hurts her feelings or hurts their feelings. Offended. Uh, yeah, is, is that, is that, <laughs> you are now offended. <laughs> <laughs> is that a condition? It's a charm. <laughs> yeah. Can I. duck behind a tree and just spin out and try to use my action hide? Am I allowed to do that? Absolutely. You totally can. You duck behind a tree, roll a stealth check. Oh, God damn. I stood on the wrong side of the tree. <laughs> <laughs> you, like, you look back at them, look at the group, and you like spin around. Oh you like do a full God. 360 and back up against the tree, and you're like. <laughs> <laughs> you see everyone That's just there. so awkward. Like, there's like a few seconds where you're like, <laughs> there's no one there. Oh. Uh, <laughs> right, next time, the cow, top of the round. Quintan, it doesn't, I'm gonna speak, I respond to Nokian, it doesn't have to be like this. Call off your forces. Um. <laughs> um. <laughs> You're supposed to be in the mountain. <laughs> <laughs> I'm working. No one has to die here. Um, do you do anything else? A cow? Uh, uh. A cow's just like speaking in this like harsh but sing-songy kind of dialect. Oh. That you've never heard him speak before, except for once within the seal. It's mm -hmm. like beatbox. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> complete opposite. Oh, God. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Uh, cow. Uh. These are my friends. I'm sorry, and I'll turn around and I'm gonna cast Magic Missile on the other guy. All right, uh, that just automatically hits. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna, <laughs> Go just, I'm gonna do that first level though. So. Go for his nads. Go for his nads. Yeah, it means right for his nads. It. So. Oh, I can't read so that. Two. <clears throat> plus four is six. Plus four is ten. Ten points of damage to that guy. To flutter. Oh shit. Oh, he's <laughs> oh, not looking shit. good. Um. <laughs> oh, that's exactly what he's <laughs> like blast into him. He's barraged with these bullets of arcade energy and he's pushed back away from Gil, but he like lets go of him. Oh. Um, and just like you see blood, white blood sprays onto the ground. Gross. Um, yeah, it's pussy. It's gross. Uh, that's your turn? Yeah, that'll. Did I feel the other energy dissipate as well? Are there any other energies on my body? <laughs> there are currently no energies on your body. Okay, cool. And then I'll move towards Gilded. Thanks. All right. Um, uh. Take a step, to, you go towards Gilded. Cool, <laughs> next up is Flutter, um, who looks at Quinton 
uh, like cocks his head. Ooh, actually. You watch as he like traces, like kind of like swivels his hand at his hip and you see like arcane energy like weave between his fingers. And um, from that, it like shoots up his arm and is like, there's like a flash of white around his head and you all feel a presence in your mind. Is it a charm? Like, it is not a charm. <laughs> Elves, am I right? Uh, that should go on a shirt. Is it a charm? Yeah. Um, Elves, am I right? <laughs> and he looks towards Quinton and then looks to you, Cal. Um, can you give me five gold coins <laughs> in real life. Where, One where million dollars. I don't have that much. I'm I poor. Wish, man. <laughs> are, are you poor, like, actually? I'm, I'm seriously, I don't, I you think, guys take all the money. Yeah, we're all doing pretty well, I think. Wisdom save throw, please. <laughs> Wisdom, Wisdom save. Wisdom. It's cocked. It's cocked. Oh, shit, that was good. That I, was it looked really good. good. That's even better. That's, whoa. Shit. Wow. Good uh, that's a 23. You feel almost someone trying to press into your mind, like a physical pounding headache that gets harder and harder, like somebody knocking on a door in your head, but you manage to keep it shut. Um, that's cool. They look back at Quentin and goes, I feel we've held them up long enough. You can either stay and fight us, or try and save your friend who's probably bleeding out. What? You know where Thorn is? Fr Freya? <laughs> he like punches up in the sky, and you guys all feel this <laughs> gravity intensifies all around you. Um, I will get you all to roll a constitution saving throw. That's exactly it's not why a charm, not is it? <laughs> oh, oh <shit>. that's gone. <laughs> that's gone. <laughs> or just throw your die across the room. Yeah. Uh, constitution? Yeah. I'll take whatever that is. <laughs> uh, Gilwin. 17. 17, success. Four. Four. 11. All right. Uh, and Flutter. Wait, Flutter also gets fucked in two? <laughs> yeah, absolutely. <laughs> There's no picking and choosing. You guys watch as the tr branches break around you, a cle like completely clears the trees. Everything drops, your armor becomes heavy, and you see the air almost sucked to the ground. Um, Cal and Joy, you both take, oh wow. Oh, you both take 14 Ooh. points of force damage and your speed oh, is halved as you feel gravity increase around you. Gilwin, you take seven points and you are fine. No, I'm not. Oh, she's Just down again. So oh, no. <laughs> I am not fine. Uh, Gilwin, Gilwin feels the force. Everybody's kind of collapsing in. And I... Uh, just oh. pass out. Can I uh, stay um, from the ground? Just, like, face first. Get fucked! And, uh... <laughs> Hellish Rebuke. Oh! <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, saving throw. Con? Dex. Uh, Dex saving throw. Yeah, just saving oh, throw. Oh, shit. <laughs> Not good. Not good. Uh, oh, that's so funny. That has to get oh, a 11. Oh, yeah, that's a failure. <laughs> yeah. sure. This guy get went fucked. on the ground. Get on the ground. Yeah. Get fucked. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I think Emily would like that one. <laughs> mm, that's really not good, though. Uh, that's. Eight points of damage. Eight points of damage. Makes me sad. That's low? Yeah, yeah that's, that's low quite low. Tribute. That's yeah. a maximum of 30. Oh. I mean, one third's okay. Yeah. Uh, what does your Hellish Rebuke look like? Um, from around me, uh, the ground ripples and these like black smoke flames kind of come out from behind <laughs> me. So uh, and then they just reach out and as they move through the like the the broken branches and we uh, and like weeds, you hear like musical chimes, like uh, uh, like the the chime of of those wind chimes nice. as it goes and, and hits them. Yeah, yeah. That's cool. <sighs> Walks over, uh, grabs Flutter by the arm, throws him over his shoulder, begins to walk away. 
Time's running out, losers. <laughs> oh my god, walks into the forest. <laughs> so good. Oh, no, can't talk like that. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Cal, Cal has Cal has a lisp in Nokia. <laughs> yeah, in common, he doesn't have a lisp. Yeah. Um, who, who taught him how to speak common? <laughs> Sounds atrocious. Um, next up is Gilwin. Roll another death save, please. Oh my gosh. Yeah, how many? He's gone down like twice. Yeah. Twice We're in gonna... like one minute, less than a minute. Gilwin, so that's an at twenty. Uh, ten. Is a success. Is a ten is at half. Whew. Um, Joy. I uh, got any more healing <laughs> Uh, Yeah, I got something for you, buddy. Um, <laughs> casting it at second level this time. All right. So that's all I got left. Uh, for nine points of healing. And Cal. Uh, just try to get up. Yeah, you stand up. Everything is very, very heavy. Um, but you manage to stand, and your each step takes a lot of strength. Put my mask back on and uh, head follow the direction that he went. That he went? Or where's 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 Thorn? You guys know the direction was like north of you, and he went east. Head towards Thorn. Okay. Sure. To every your step is like each step is increasingly harder, and then after like a few seconds, it after about thirty feet, you'd say. No, after 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 about ten. Oh, really? Okay, cool. Um, yeah. Next up, gone. Uh, Gilwin, you're up. <coughs> it's safe to say, if you guys are not chasing them, we're no longer in initiative. Uh, if I'm up, can I bonus action heat metal and make him take more damage? <laughs> it's until the spell ends. <laughs> uh, roll a con. No, you went unconscious. Unfortunately, it's concentration, right? Yeah. Unfortunately, a drop. That's actually how it works, right? That makes sense. Right? Yeah. I lose concentration because I'm dead, so yeah, <laughs> twice. Correct. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah. Cool. Uh, how does everybody look? Oh, I'm fucking hurt. I don't fucking care. Let's go. Um, okay. I'm just going to uh, uh, cast Healing Spirit and let it walk with us and heal all three of us. Thank you. Okay. Um, I'll Good tell man. you guys how much it is as we're walking. Where's... But then where's Freya? Fuck. I have no idea right now. And with that, we're gonna go to break. Uh, four? <laughs> Everybody four? Wait, Thank on. you so much for joining into the first half of We Split the Party. I hope you enjoyed some of our newest features in the chat. Lewis is manning We Split the Party's chat right now. Thank you, Lewis. <laughs> Thank you so much to the team who's put together all this hard work. <laughs>